Hello everyone and welcome back to Sonic Frontiers. As I said at the very end of the last episode, I uh, changed my outfit as we will see. There we go, I actually haven't put on the adventure shoes and gloves and I already think they're hideous. Anyways, um, I don't care what you say, you, you just ramble on. So that's all I really care about is getting my shit upgraded. Alright. Alright, there we go. Anyways, I'm quickly going to do this little puzzle. There we go. I know a lot of these puzzles are piss easy, but uh, they, they do at least take you a minute to see, you know, the full picture than the pattern. Um, what are my objectives? Talk to Amy and get Chaos Emeralds. I guess I could, could go ahead and talk to Amy real quick. Or I could want to go to the you know what? No, I'm, I'm going to talk to Amy. That's another thing I am going to do as far as completion goes. I'm going to try and talk to every character however many times you talk to them. Hey, yo, Amy. Who's your friend? Amy's right over there. Um. Ooh. Ah, oh, shit, but that has to wait till night. Oh, well, wait a minute. It's almost night. Ah! It just turned night. I'll go ahead and do this just to get it over, over with. But, um. Yeah, I really like Frontiers. If you've played Frontiers, or if you've been kind of on the fence about it, uh, let me know. What were your thoughts on the game, and uh, if you have played it, how far have you gotten in it? Because, uh, you know, again, I've already been in the whole thing, so, you know. But even for me, like, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. I, I, the story alone makes me rate the game on an 8 out of 10. Everything else kind of makes up for that, uh, the rest of that percentage. Even the, uh, annoyances in the game make up, make up for it, in my opinion. There is a... right over there. Yeah, I'll go ahead and take out the tower, dude. Another big dude. By the way, one thing I do not like about any boss in this game, or mostly these, uh, you know, these guardian bosses, what I don't like about them is the fact that, you know, almost all of them have a one-shot move. Some of them, it's, you know, it's fairly easy to dodge. Others, it's like, what the fuck, Sega? I'm just gonna go ahead and say it, Sonic Team deserves all the credit for this. Sega did not do 
shit for this, which is good. The less involvement Sega has with Sonic, the better the games turn out. Come on, come on! Ah. This is the only annoying part of this boss, how sometimes you can... Uh. Uh, sometimes it can feel kind of inconsistent, you know, as far as climbing up up it goes. It feels very inconsistent, um, as far as, you know, uh, momentum and climbing up it goes. I'm gonna quickly get some extra rings. I'm not gonna try and max out or anything, I just wanna get extra rings. That should be enough. And I'll go ahead and do this map puzzle. It's another little time trial, which is awesome, because I love the time trial missions. Uh, where am I going? Top of tower? Top of the tower, please. Alright, that should be easy from what I remember. Although if I did have just one bad thing to say about the general movement of Frontiers, it's that we're definitely going to see this later on in the game, where I noticed it is in the Second Island areas, I believe it's called, and um, that is the fact that while wow, running around and moving, um, it is extremely easy to um, like clip through things, like... Like, even on scripted segments, it's very easy to clip through things and fuck it up. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and talk to Sage, since we're right here. So there's a not only there's a cyberspace level here. Let's go. Oh, and there's Amy. Talk to Amy. Even though my objective is to talk to Amy. In my opinion, it's kind of weird to pull off. Anyways, uh, 20 scope. What's the. Oh, yeah, homing shot. Ooh, 20 scope points. I might get the stomp attack beforehand. Now nah, I'm gonna focus on getting that.
Oh shoot, I might need to end off this video um, a little bit early. I get a lot early. Huh, let me go check and see if I do. I was wrong. I've got a lot more time than I thought I did. Oh shoot, where did I put my... There's my controller. Anyways, uh, yeah, let's quickly do a cyberspace level. But all I do know is, um, when I did start this recording session, I knew I was kind of crunched on time. I only have like an hour to record. But, yeah, I should be able to still get a lot done. Well, maybe not a lot, but yeah, I can still get quite a bit done. Considering the fact that I already have, you know, like, two, two more Chaos Emeralds that are literally right there waiting for me to get right now. Yeah. I should do a video right, like a short, like, ten minute or so video where I just go through and that's like the whole video. I just do the training mode, see how far I can get. There we go. Come on, don't get stuck to the floor. You bitch. You fucking bitch. One thing that does make me fairly upset about Frontiers is the fact that all the cyberspace stages have this really nice music, but um, they're not memorable because they're just over tracks that have extremely iconic themes. So the music isn't going to be remembered, and in most times these levels are forgettable because with only four themes in general, you know, like, um, you got your Green Hill theme, you got your- shit, again! Anyways, you have, um, Green Hill, you got Chemical Plant, Sky Sanctuary, what I have put together and assume is... City Escape. Maybe just like a weird combination of various city levels. But if I had to come to the city level by name, yeah, I'd say the city one is probably City Escape. You know. Um. What else is it? Um. Yeah, but that, that just sucks because like the music is very forgettable. Or, it's not that the music is forgettable, but within the stages that it's in, no one's gonna remember it. But um Oops. Oh, not that. There we go. Wait, is my difficulty on hard? Just for the second that I thought I paused and it said hard mode, because, ah, uh, fuck. Because anytime throughout the game, if the difficulty is set on hard whatsoever, you then get to fight the true final boss, which fucking sucks ass. Okay, now it's on normal, thank god. Alright, um... Quit fiddle farting around. Let's go talk to Amy. Where is she? There she is.
<laughs> so excited Sonic looks to see Amy. <laughs> like a dog when you call when you call them over. This one mother says she's lost her children. Damn it, the ugly ass, um, adventure outfit is trying to grow on me. Like, it's jarring to see Son to see, uh, it on Sonic, but, you know, it's at least growing on me in terms of looks. Mostly because it doesn't look that bad in motion. And there we go. That's a super easy mission. Like, I almost hate how piss easy it is. There we go. I might make that my profile picture. Sonic sitting here with the chaos, and I'm like, eh, you know. Got another talk to Amy mission, but again, I I want to goof off a bit. Not the cyberspace level. Yeah, that's the one I just did. Is oh, there's a thing over there I didn't do. That's well, very important that I do that immediately. Drop everything that I'm doing. Oh hey, Coco. Also, I drop everything that I'm doing to murder you, my friend. How dead? abilities that I unlock. Oh, right, the, uh, fucking, um, the air dash thing here, I forget what it's called. Alright. I can't believe I missed this challenge. Oh, and it's one of these. These are, these are nice little challenges. It's literally just testing out how good are you at how good are you at quick stepping. It's less of a challenge and more of just uh, padding. It's not even padding. I can't even say that with a straight face. Like none of this game feels like padding. Hello there, now eradicated enemy. Really? Nothing from you? Wow, what a load of shit. Ooh, portal, portal right over there. It's only been 20 minutes, and I've barely done anything actually story related. How lovely. At least I got a Chaos Emerald. 
That's something at least. And again, I did say at the start of the series I plan to 100% every island. So, yeah, it... Oof. I keep trying to estimate how long each video is going to take me, but I just end up unironically making it take longer for myself. Ah, shit. Fuck. Cyberspace, but first I want to kill you because I desperately want the XP. I mean, yeah, it's kind of a good idea to level up as, up as much as possible, so that way later on you can just blast through the game. Or less of blast and more of just be able to sh destroy shit. Which is awesome. And soon I should try and find big fishing stuff. So I, I don't, I'm thinking I'm going to dedicate videos just to fishing with Big the Cat. Just so that way I can complete the fishing stuff. For me what I count as 100% is doing all of Big's fishing. Uh, completing the maps, and... And, um... Talking to every character. After that, uh... Com Again, if you rather do more for completion, you could. It's just for me, personally, I'm not gonna... I don't really want to go through the trouble of getting every memory token. Or, you know, collecting every portal gear. For me, all I need to be happy with this game is to have every red star ring. Which, even then, I'm not doing every red star ring. Because I've already done that. Well, I did it just because I wanted to. And yeah, I, I, I don't think I'm, I might go back and do it. But I don't really want to. I might do it once I have fast travel anymore. Yeah, my plan is to unlock fast travel, and then from there go through and do everything else that the game has to offer, especially as far as cyberspace stages go. I'm probably going to go through and do... I'm probably going to go through and get the red rings I've missed just because, well... I just like collecting red rings, and look at that! First fucking try, like, all I did is just go for the red rings, and I got an S rank with seconds to spare. Only three, but still, seconds to spare is seconds to spare. There you go, training's over. Kinda thirsty, not gonna lie. Some mode, something like that. Okay. I'm gonna start skipping these. Cool. Oh, Coco. I'm gonna need you later for farming. Well, even then, I could just use uh, Big the Cat for farming. Okay. Uh. There's a puzzle right over here, man. Alright, I'm gonna do this puzzle, and then I'm talking to Amy. Alright, where is this puzzle? I keep getting distracted. I mean, then again, that's a good thing, because there's plenty of stuff for me to do in the game. I mean, in my opinion, that's a sign of good game development when there's too much to do. And you keep... Like, you're not overwhelmed, but you keep getting distracted by a little thing. Aha. Uh -huh. Easy puzzle. Oh, there is one type of puzzle that I really don't like. I'm just going to go ahead and say on the third island, it is especially important that you complete every challenge and puzzle before doing the story, because once you get to a certain point, a... You ah, fuck. You can't complete every challenge on the third island if you do it after the fact. But you can still get 100% on it. Anyways, I don't want to miss out on the seed. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Ah, oh, damn it, there's another puzzle! 
Aim me first. Alright, what you need, Ames? How fucking annoyed Sonic is. You again? Submit. Your reckless actions endanger the world. Care to explain how saving my friends is a bad thing? You are an enemy combatant. I will not share data with you. What is wrong with you? Sonic would never endanger anyone. He's even going to help this Coco reunite with their one true love. Coco, no. Come on, Sega, just go ahead and say it. Do it, you won't. Oh, wait a minute, you really aren't. Oh, crap. Uh, do it, you will. Oh, hello, friend. Goodbye, friend. Not even a, not even worth the trouble. It's starting to rain. I really hate it whenever it rains. I, I like that there's weather and dynamic daytimes and all that, but I hate the I hate the rain. So I saw a sage thing over here somewhere. Let's go ahead and talk to a brat. Ooh. And a treasure fish. Ooh, hold a key. It will help me move around fast if I, number one, get on loaded boost, number two, maybe, uh, quickly just max out my ring count. There we go. There's also a puzzle here, t okay. I'm gonna do this puzzle, I'm gonna talk to Sage, and then call it a video. Coco's nearby. Because I could also quickly talk to him and start increasing my speed. He's right here. Wow, I can't believe I walked right by him. Alright, I'm only going to worry about increasing the speed, because, you know, realistically that's the only one you need to. You can increase ring count, but that's more of like a post-game thing, to be honest, than a... There's a puzzle right over here, too! Damn it, game! Stop getting me so many damn puzzles to do. How did, what did I miss over here? Oh, right, say that's what I was doing over here. That's not my whole reason for coming over here. Alright, what do you have to say now, you emo little brat? I'm kidding, I love Sage. She's the she's best. Oh, hey. You show well, up anywhere. Anywhere. best girl. You know, I, I don't think we were ever properly introduced. I'm Sonic. I know who you are. Your age, your biometrics, your weaknesses. Your weaknesses are Sonic. 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 I will not share personal information with an enemy. Why are we enemies? <sighs> Kid. I don't want to get a bad vibe off of her, though. <sighs> and 
I really don't want to end off the series. I don't want to end this video off, to be honest, but I really am running out of time for recording today, and even then, um, I don't know how much phone storage I have left. I probably should have checked that beforehand. But, uh, thank you all so much for watching today's video. I see the puzzle over here, so I guess I'll brutally murder this innocent man in cold blood. Aw, oh, man. Aw, oh, man. Well, now I have reason to kick murder him. Self-defense. Sonic the Murder only murders on self-defense. And after I attacked him, he then defended himself, which makes it self-defense, and which also gives me the right to now murder him. Guess that makes sense. Anyways, um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please do leave a like down below. Maybe comment your thoughts on the on what on what we've done so far. And I hope you all God, there's so many things. And I hope you all look forward to uh, more Frontiers coverage coming soon. Anyways, uh, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.